What up team, it is about 8.15 at um, some overflow campground pretty close to Long's Peak. The plan for tomorrow is basically to take Long's Peak trail just all the way up. Reading all reports, it should be absolutely jam-packed with people. So we're gonna try to get a real alpine start and catch it before the big crowds. After the week we've had, we are really giving her the beans on this one. My legs feel okay. I think if I don't say the amount of mile a chicken bird we've done in the last couple days, they won't know. So that's my strategy. We just jogged it from the car to, I don't know, first 100 yards up the trail. And two things became very, very clear very, very quickly. First thing, John didn't have his poles. Uh, so he's going back and grabbing them. Uh, second thing, we are at elevation and the running is for the way down. Not gonna lie, I was extremely unhappy when my alarm went off at 3.20 in the morning. But right now, we are 3.3 miles away from the peak and getting an absolute treat of some colors. So it's worth it. disappointed when I thought we were in the boulder field because the trail was just like a green circle for the first like five miles and then we're now very much in a boulder field so I guess we kind of earned its name we are so out here Shout out Blast Bar Tube right here. Whatever you guys are doing, keep it up. Maybe it's the elevation, maybe it's the distance, but I am absolutely worked right now. That's it, Long's Peak via the keyhole route. It took us about 7.8 miles, about four hours to this point to ascend. Um, half the journey is still yet to come, but man, that was some type one fun, 14,200 feet or something. It is windless. Like, shocking. Like, I feel kind of disappointed. I'm also happy though. <laughs> but we are 7.8 miles in, enjoying our sandwich, 
probably gonna get back to the car around 11 <laughs> and uh find some body of water to jump into find a burger joint yep and call it a day but holy heck man holy heck would you do that again john maybe <laughs> we've upgraded to a maybe i'll uh -huh. take it <laughs> absolutely stunned Classic head throbbing signs of altitude affecting me right now, so it's taking it nice and slow. Enjoy the views, enjoy the weather. John's just trying to make things a little bit more Pants just came off with about three miles to go. You know what that means, but I am having a great day. That's all she wrote, folks. Uh, Clocked in uh, before noon. Oh, so, it's still morning? Yeah, it is still no morning. Way. It's 11.45. No way. Um, cooked that last 5K. John was just telling me what. Like, Wait, that's the way to finish. Like the whole... Just the whole week. That's our last mission. Like, well, we started with 10 miles at Great Basin doing Wheeler, yep. 10 miles to Amphitheater at the Grand Teton, 24 miles in the uh, up Cascade and paintbrush in the Tetons, and then absolutely murdered a 15 miler up Lo Long's Peak in the Grand, uh, Rocky Mountain. Ugh. That's a week, folks. That's a big week. That's a week. Man, oh man, shout out, John. That was, that was freaking, sweet. freaking nuts. That was sweet.